you just skip this next team because like it's not just it, there's no point. They're just they're good. Every team is good. They have like three elevens that can just beat anybody. Are we talking about Columbus? Yeah. Columbus. Adam, you want to talk about or no, let's yeah, because Connor's taking Orlando. So you got to talk about Columbus. Give us a starting eleven. Give us our second starting eleven. That's a discuss. I need to get a drink of water. That second so, eleven. <laughs> yeah. So we we've touched on Columbus before. I mean, obviously the transfer window is still open. I wouldn't be surprised if Cristiano Ronaldo comes in next, play alongside Jesse's artist. But like, <laughs> who, who whoever's leading Columbus after winning MLS Cup last season just basically said, okay, um, last season was good. Let's do that for the next like four years. Um, like one of the arguably most dominant MLS Cup finals that I can remember watching. It, it looked boring. It was easy. Um, congratulations again to Derek Etienne Jr. for winning MLS Cup because he was never going to do that in New York. Not yet. He might if he came when he when he comes back. Yeah. Um. But Caleb Porter is obviously still there. They finished third in the East, fourth overall in the league. But, like, doesn't really matter when you bring home the trophy at the end. Um, their roster is silly. They went and, you know, brought in some guy named Kevin Molino, who was okay last season. Uh, they brought in some goalkeeper named Evan Bush, who was, you know, okay. Like, I, who was letting this happen? They brought in Bradley Wright Phillips because, you know, they needed another striker. I hate Columbus. <laughs> They're so good. <laughs> They're, They're gonna be just, so, so, so good. So good. Um, did, did I hear I, – I had to go get a drink of water. Did I hear you say that Cristiano Ronaldo would start next to Zardes? Don't you know he's yes. on the wrong side of 30? So, you know, he'd never get into this team because he's on the wrong side of 30 and he, his hair doesn't have a blonde stripe down the middle? I'm sure you could put a blunt. I mean, he's there. not wrong. I, I know. Why don't Why don't you go compare how many goals Cristiano Ronaldo has in MLS versus Jesse's artist, and come back to me and tell me why Ronaldo should be starting? Numbers don't lie. Numbers I mean, do not yeah. lie. He's got it there. <laughs> Sorry, Cristiano. But yeah, I mean, yeah, I'm clipping that. I'm putting that on TikTok. <laughs> I'm kind of canceled. <laughs> so realistically. I don't even know. Four, two, three, one again. I mean, why change something that's not broken? It's what they won everything last year with. So I assume that's they're just gonna do the same thing and improve on it again. So obviously Eli Room starts in goal. Then you have like some combination of awful warm gore, Jonathan Mensa and Valenzuela across the back, but you're also leaving off like Hairston, Keita, Frank, like they're just it's not fair. Um, midfield options of like Artur, Darlington Nagby, Perry Kitchen, Matan, their new signing, Zella Ryan, and then San Pedro Santos, Molino, Zardes. Like, this team is silly. <laughs> <laughs> this shouldn't be a thing. It's so tough to talk about key players when they're entire just everybody. Up. Everybody yes, have a literally. decent year and you guys will be all right. Yeah. <laughs> And even if you don't, this this feels like a Man City esque roster, especially in MLS where the rosters are so tight money wise. To have two starting 11s that could re realistically go out and compete with most teams. So they're the you know who their third goalie is just to because why not? No, I don't. Matt Lampson, so former Chicago Matt, goalie. Matt, Matt Lampson started like three years ago. Yeah, that's unreal. They have three arguably starting quality goalies just because. <sighs> he started for Chicago. Let's relax. <laughs> this the second team, though, the second team could probably challenge for a playoff spot. Absolutely. Which is ridiculous. BWP on the bench could score. BWP at the end junior could fucking. Oh, man, that's unreal. Um, this team is silly. It is. It's very silly. Third in the East, fourth in the league, one MLS Cup, obviously. Um, Caleb Porter in charge. Does anybody need to have a good 2021? Like, No. You need to have a halfway decent season 
and you will still probably walk to minimally walk to a playoff spot, if not like another Eastern Conference final, if not another MLS Cup final. We have to remember that this is MLS, which means they're going to finish with like four wins this year. Yeah, true. That is, that's fair. Zardes has to win Golden Boot, otherwise Connor is going to cry. Yeah. I, I mean, you could almost make the argument that everybody in that starting 11 would have to have a good 2021 because of how deep this team is. It's like as soon as you start slacking, they can replace you with like with a snap of their fingers. Yeah. And that's – that. like I said, that that's why I draw so many comparisons to um, Man City because that's the exact way that Man City function. They go, oh, man, you can't play? See ya. Here's the bench. Bernardo Silva, go ahead, have fun. Then Bernardo Silva starts messing up. They're like, all right, go back on and, and play again. It's just constant rotation of quality, which is going to be really fun to watch. <sighs> like, think of how many combinations you can play in this team. Like, you can put Artur, you know, Aiden Morris, and Matan as a as a midfield three. If he, one of them gets tired, just you know, throw on one of the best attacking players in the league last year in Zella Rayon. Like, what? their their rest games are going to have roster or are going to have 11s that are better than some teams actual starting 11s oh yeah that's so dumb mm-hmm. that's so dumb well you're going to tell me the second 11 can't arguably beat new york city or houston i beat fcc or vancouver yeah or atlanta <laughs> no atlanta signed alan franco they're in the they're in the running for supporter shield yeah, I'm yeah, they myself, are. I'm preparing myself for the other dumb stuff you're about to say for Orlando. I'm just getting it all out now. <sighs> are we done with this? Are we done? Is there anything else we need to talk about? No, no. And they're oh, there is, but we'll get that next week. But their jerseys are cool too. <laughs> Not even like they, they ugly jerseys. I can't. <laughs> I can't. Yeah, I can't even make fun of their jerseys because they look cool too.